Yeah. All right, so black pink, Jack. Black pink. Nice so and center map. A, a little bit of a better map for Zerg, for sure. Yeah, this is a good center map, I think. Dude, what, how crazy would it be if Zanster 2 0 is T Y? Yeah. 2 1, you mean? Or 2 1. Yeah, let me set up the things. Yeah, this is, no, this is not a bad track map at all. Because you know how you have to push for a 4 base? Mm -hmm. But, like, if you double expand. Oh? Is he gonna do it again? <laughs> no, no, no. You don't think he's gonna do no. Rex? He's gonna do maybe. Like Rex Factor Wall? Yes. On the low ground? This map is just bad for Trinity. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm, <laughs> I was gonna be very surprised. Is he sending another SCV? No, no, no. You do it with the same one. Okay, never no, mind. No. I mean, he was clicking here. Yeah, but it was just with this SCV. Yeah. All right, let's introduce our players. In the top right-hand corner. She what? They, uh, they clipped it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. In the top right-hand corner, playing for Team Psystorm Gaming, it is Sandster. Nice. In the bottom left, losing a surprising game from Splice, T.Y. Nice. Seen enough of Juanito to last me a lifetime. Yes. <laughs> uh, cohesion for two rexes with the overlords, that's safe play. The f well, the first one, yeah, do you know where you go? This, yeah, this one's just going here. Yeah, but that one, that was like, went to the third. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, this is just this is just like what you should do. Like, there's no reason not to do it, yeah. so you might as well do it. Uh, in my opinion, though, if you scout a two rex, you're just scouting your death. No, you play like, around and you win. No, no, no. Well, like, depending, I guess. If this overlord just instantly scouts a two rex here, the two rex are fucked up. Yeah, it's all you know, like, if it's hidden and you just barely see it, like, you're just scouting your death if your hatch is already down. You can't pull drones, like, you, all the way across I think the, the perfect response is to pull drones and kill the, the CVs, build a bunker, yeah. and then go back. Because yeah. if there's no bunker on the go, you can't really break the hatch, right? Yeah, I agree. So Which I is think, really hard, though. Yeah, I know it's hard, but that's, I think that's what you have to do. Try to not lose too many drones and try to break the SCVs. Yeah, so there is the Rax Factor yeah. wall off. Why, why is, what's the point of this? Can you lift now? Uh, you just have a wall already. That's yeah, but like, so you can be way more jolo with your head you know? Yeah. But you don't have to worry about the run by potential. I think this is actually better since the Overlord nerf too. What nerf? Like this could be a little bit sketchy when you had Overlord drops at like... Um, ah, okay. <laughs> like what nerf? <laughs> no, well, that, that was a pretty big nerf, no? I don't know. Uh, well, they got buffed in the 4.0, you know? they faster. Yeah, well that was... Yeah, that was confused that was by nerf, CBC. what are you talking about? Yeah, but it helps a lot against Terran. Yeah. You know, before you had some people play over speed to actually scout. Now you don't even need to. Yeah. I mean, I think it's fair. Not really. You think it's un imbalanced that Zerg can actually scout things? You can scout the lanes or make an upgrade. How can I scout the wall? You can scout the wall with lanes. Yeah. But, like, if this was up here, you'd never scout it because there would just be Hellions and shit down here. Like, I, I don't think it's ever imbalanced to have more scouting, of, scouting awareness or scouting ability. Like, yeah. Pro Protoss has insane scouting ability. Yeah, Protoss is the best at scouting, for sure. And even if we lose our Overlords, that's actually pretty good for you guys, in my opinion. Like, if you kill an Overlord, that's supply and minerals that we need yeah. to rebuild. I mean, I'm not saying this. I'm just saying that. Oh. Before you had to make Overlord speed, now you don't. Oh, nice. Who's that big? Yeah, this is gonna be big. Oh. Unless he wants medevac boost upgrade. And you know what's good? He's making a Liberator with a Tech Lab yeah. that's made from the DARPA. He will never think about this, right? No, he won't. Oh, yeah, he'll never scout it. Oh, he cancelled it in front What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what was the point of that? Hey, there's a Lingra run, run, run by. This is... Okay, he's trying to cut it first. Yeah, I don't know if this is gonna... Well, this definitely isn't gonna do anything. There's no, a wall. There's a wall. That's why that's one... That's one to keep it there. Yeah. He might... Well, he brought all the Hellions back. You Honestly, see, that's pretty good yeah, already. That's, but you see what I mean? You can be way more YOLO with your Hellions. Like, you don't have to leave any of them. Yeah, for sure. I like it a lot more. Right? I really well, like it. this is good for mech, but if you play bio, this is pretty terrible. Oh, he's trying to get caught no. here. That was really weird. So there's two segments on their way as well. Yeah, he scouted though. That's actually a really, really good scout. Yeah. He should, he should be getting ready. Oh. He's building so many drones. And yeah. Way too many drones, I think. Where's the Liberator going here? Uh, it's right here. Oh, this is another of them. Little job, little job. Look at this meme, he's going cloak banshee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's going like. Like, with this setup, normally when you walk like this, you really can't go by. Because the tech lab, you know, can do it. Yeah, probably. He drones, so definitely here. I think he drones too much. Oh, no. And the liberator? I think. Yeah. 
that. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure I can remind you this one. That'll be kind of special. Yeah, I hope you can. Yeah. Uh, at least you can deliver it to the game. After that sick second game. Yeah. <laughs> he just died in the first time. Oh, this is gonna be good, boy. He's gotta clean this up. Yeah. Oh, this is so good. If he was able to do this immediately, yeah. that would be way different. And there's a clock bench too, going. Yeah, the clock bench is gonna be so much too. There's no spawn here. That's the biggest thing. If it goes in the main, which it is, then maybe. But he saw the spawn main move, right? <coughs> you know what's boring. Normally, Surge don't move it again. So, we just board like off, sta off state of the. Look at the main base. It's a certain. Yeah, the Yeah, let's see that. The spore is possible. Now, like you don't normally move it back. You know? This is like the biggest fighting game ever. He's like, I canceled the cloak. I make the cloak. I make cloak again. <laughs> He's not getting a support call here either. He's getting over here. So. Yeah. So, so far, this was a better hold than I was expecting, but. <laughs> right, I think it's yeah, I think he's pretty far behind. Well, not pretty, but he's behind. Rush one on the way. I well, wonder. What is. Can you click D? Two armory, two more factory. Yeah, this is for sure. I don't like Rush versus Mech in general. What? I mean. No, it's good too. Rush too. It's good, but if you're behind. Ah, yeah, another no. thing. I, I, I guess, I just feel like you need to come back somehow, you know? Yeah. Like you need to be able to just build a million drones. <clears throat> well, yeah, that's the point. You, you make some roaches, so you can die to well, I mean, if you build like five roaches, I didn't get to do shit, you know? Well, they use protect for wrong bites, right? And you make a lot of drones. You make a hive really fast. But this is like two later roach hunt to really do this. Yeah. And TY is already making forces at the same time as a hatchery with this work hatchery. Yeah, so. yeah that's, so that's what I was talking about. I really think that Zamster. I mean, I guess if he doesn't build any roaches, I'm happy with it, but like if you build a bunch of roaches now, you're... Ah, yeah, you you should one. definitely not build many. Like, like, for example, roaches are really shit against this Thor drop bullshit. <clears throat> in my opinion, I think you really just need a heavy ling with queens. And I, don't, I don't think roaches ever add anything to that. Plus, I think the only thing he really needs roaches for is the Hallian Road bias. Like, yeah. they don't also do much for cyclones or anything either. But look, he built like seven roaches and six roaches, not many. And he made a infestation pit, hydrogen, four hatch, and then make a hive. Mm -hmm. So that's like. Yeah, he just needs more drones though. So yeah. He's only building two drones right now. Yeah. Five roaches. So this is what I was talking about. Or yeah. I don't play. Like. Yeah. But we'll see. I guess if you knew, you probably wouldn't build roaches here. Like, it's just, they're, they're just not going to do anything, so. So many hellions, though. <laughs> I guess the roaches can do something in this number. Yeah, it's not bad. I did it very quick. Juicy. But there's two matches too. Like, this is gonna be nasty. Look, he's gonna go in Ranchy somewhere, and the door drop somewhere, and maybe run by somewhere. Yeah, this is gonna be a little bit of everything. Oh, maybe he fight together with the other. Yeah, this might transform me all the hell out. I don't think it's worth it. So many roaches. Yeah, the doors do so much damage to roaches. I guess, yeah. yeah I guess he's not from the actual. <coughs> If these paints are closer on top, that would be really bad. Yeah. Well, the pants are super impressive here. Yeah, this is not going to go up. This is not going to wall jack? No. But I think, for example, what I was talking about before, like, Link Bane Hydra would really pick this up. It wasn't the paints of the hell that's what. But, like, yeah. it's just got a mixture of a lot of. The problem with Link Bane Hydra is kind of bad, I guess. Right? No. It was better than the last Yeah, it's pretty big ass. I mean, like, the before 4.0, you yeah. know? In Blitz Compact. Right. Yeah, I mean, he's already bleeding out too much. Yeah. I think. He did hold, but. Like, yeah, well, he does right a hatchery, hit the bench, start drinking some black shit. And then comes like Shackman. Yeah. Well, they get any Shackman. That's always annoying, isn't it? <clears throat> yeah. But I mean, if these Banshees die, that would be worth the Banshees. Nah, so <laughs> Antar is in a... In a pickle. Uh, yeah, I don't see how he's gonna push, defend the push that's gonna come when it's like 2-2. Two, two. Yeah. I mean, I don't either. Like, if he didn't lose this base, even if he lost every drone at this base, I think that would be okay. Like, it's not good, don't get me wrong. 86 points <laughs> from TY. 86. Yeah. His saturation is... It's too much. It's like it's oversaturated in almost all of his bases. Well, he knows he's gonna work his axe that for his base. You think so? Which no. That's <laughs> Yes, like many workers. Yeah, he's, so he's, he's still building them. 
We know 90, boys. Look, so he's fully saturated. He's oversaturated this space, uh -huh. right? He's oversaturated this space. He's oversaturated this space. And he's not yet oversaturated this space, but he will be soon. He's rallying. I was going to say, he's rallying this to a saturated, oversaturated base. Yeah. It's honestly not that bad, but yes. Well, it's totally that bad. I mean, they still mine more. It's like right? 15 workers more than he needs. <laughs> right? Yeah. Four. Three. Three. Four, so, three, three. Yeah. Four, three, three, seven, nine, twelve. Four, three, three. 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 Four,